Great work, lads. Come out and play on Sunday, July 8. Experience the amazing live atmosphere of AFL up close at Australia's best AFL venue when together we take on last year's premiers, Geelong Cats. Oh, yes. Sunday, July 8, 3.15pm, Metricon Stadium. Buy now at ticketmaster.com.au. The Gold Coast Suns are away in the West with an extended squad ahead of Saturday's Round 14 match against the high-flying West Coast Eagles. Injuries to several key players, coupled with the return of several proven performers, has resulted in a number of changes being made for what is expected to be a fast and free-flowing encounter at Patterson Stadium. Small forward Brandon Matera is one of a number of West Australian natives returning home for the encounter. The dynamic small forward has the ability to create scoring opportunities from nothing and will need to quickly bounce back to his goal-sneaking best if the Suns are to rise in the West. Taylor Hine is another looking forward to the weekend's match. After patiently waiting and honing his craft in a bid to earn a recall to the seniors, Hine set the benchmark for effort during the club's last match against North Melbourne and will be called to once again step up and play a crucial defensive role on Saturday. With Patterson Stadium favouring the fleet-footed, Jared Harbrow's return could not have been timed better. Harbrow had been in outstanding form for the Gold Coast Suns during the opening rounds of the 2012 season before suffering a serious elbow injury against the Brisbane Lions. The North Queenslander will provide welcome relief for his teammates when injected into the midfield fray. Michael Riscatelli, hamstring, Seb Tate, knee, Rory Thompson, ankle, and Luke Russell, hamstring, have been omitted from the side with Andrew McWalter, Jeremy Taylor and Aaron Hall, the travelling emergencies. 